Shut up, I hope you get Ooh. I will literally beat your Ooh. head in. Ooh. Just that Ooh. you can euthanize. This ends in three, two. Okay, before we get into it, I just want to point out that the logo is just the female sign with a, a crosshair. I I have nothing to say about it. I just... It's pretty epic. Welcome, everyone. We're here at Ignite Gaming Lounge. I'm Natalie Casanova, also known as Zombie Unicorn. Uh, hey, guys. I want you to take me seriously, okay? Um, I'm Michael, otherwise known as Big Slaz 567 How we doing? Okay, now let me introduce to all of you who don't know what this is. Uh, so basically, Bully Hunters is this group that was announced like a few days ago, where it's just hu hunting bullies. So basically, it's a team of people dedicated towards ending harassment against women in video games. Full stop. Um, it sounds good. What's wrong with it? We all hate bullies that make you feel small, bad, insignificant, you know. Just don't like them. Not good people, right? But you know what we do like on the Slazo channel? Respecting women. That's right. So, why don't we combine those two things and end bullies who are bullying women? Hell yeah! And we're gonna do this by making a dedicated team of gamer police. Okay, seems a bit silly, but let's see what we've got. Let's see what's happening here. I'm a Twitch streamer and longtime gamer, having worked in the industry for over six years. Okay, she's experienced, worked in the industry for years, a Twitch streamer, you know, she should know how to do this. Making gaming a more safe and special place for everyone, a more welcoming place. Oh wait, um, nah. Nah, the stream went offline like one minute in. Off to a good start. Over here, we have our casual gamers. These gamers represent you and I. They're just doing what they love to do. They're right now playing Counter-Strike Global Offensive, otherwise known as CSGO. They're playing in various game servers all across the internet. And now, over here, we have some completely different gamers, not connected into the, ga the casual gamers whatsoever in any way. These are the bully hunters. They're pro elite gamers. I like how they went to the deliberate effort of making the normal gamers, just normal gamers, and then the gamer police, they are. Assassins. Hoods up, headphones over the hoods. They are ready for business, okay? They're ready to hunt down some bullies. They just all have hoodies on. It's it's an assassin's guild. It's the dark brotherhood of gaming. Join the bully hunters now. An elite team of gamers from across the globe with a mission to free gamer girls from the evil hands of misogyny. Who are these people? Like, instead of using their skills to go join an esports team or Twitch stream and try to get popular there, they join the ranks? of the gamer police. Yeah, I'm gonna spend hours and hours perfecting a skill in this game just to spend all my days making bullies feel bad about themselves. For some reason. Do I get paid for it? Nah. I just do it. In fact, this entire place is just like a sweatshop. Like these unpaid, poor, poor workers here just slaving away while these two diabolical fiends are expanding their empire. So dumb. I mean, it is just an assassin's league, just an anti-bullying assassin squad. A bully hunter will jump into their game and take on harassment head on. They'll hunt down and take out the perpetrator. You heard that correctly. Bully hunters will get these harassers where it hurts them the most, by beating bullies at their own game. Will it happen tonight while you are watching? We don't know, but odds are yes. Okay, pause right there. Now zoom in to the bottom left corner. It says our Bully Hunter has just entered the game. See, Bully Hunter 77 has joined the game. Bully Hunter 77 is in here, okay? There are hundreds of them. This is only one. For some reason, apparently, people are just making entire accounts dedicated towards, um... I mean, the name is Bully Hunter. Just all they do all day is bully hunting. It's... it's... A hobby? Why are these people doing this? So now Bully Hunter 77 is looking for the harasser. And it looks like she's going to use her knife, folks. And there it is, just pause right there. Let's back up and see that again. A brilliant knife move, very difficult. What? How did they do that? Dude, that, that was incredible, the way you just walked right up to them and knifed them in the back. That, that was very difficult, okay? It is. Harassment is not a game. Bullyhunters.org. 
<laughs> hey guys, uh, we did it. <laughs> also, I like how all these harasses and all these examples are, well, well they have a very similar voice. <laughs> You can still hear the harassment in the background. I know where you live. It's almost as if they're the same person, just paid to act like a douche. Nah, nah, that wouldn't happen. You know, honestly, I think I'm being too harsh here, okay? Future generations are probably going to grow up dreaming, hoping to become a part of the ranks of the oh-so-prestigious bully hunters. I... <laughs> You can't even say that with a straight face. And then they get these two on. Who are they? Um, who cares? Also, I I probably shouldn't find this so funny, but the moment this poor, unfortunate piece of Ooh. shit shows his face, the entire chat just explodes calling him a soy boy. Um, it's not funny. It's very rude. And here's a general sum up of what they have to say. Um, inclusion. It's really interesting. Tell me he wants to be there. Tell me anyone here wants to be there. No. No, there's probably someone behind the scenes holding all their families hostage, just forcing them. Just, you say what's on the script or I will. I'll punch your grandma in the nose. So that's one of the elements of it. Oh, Mr. Lane, I'm Dr. Solomon. I'm so sorry to interrupt, but there is something we need to show the audience right now. Uh, in just a second here, the lights have come down and that is a signal for a bully hunt. Oh, okay, I've been waiting to see this. Let's see a real life, live bully hunt. Let's have a look. This is our casual gamer, Pinklight23, who has been harassed in game. That's her, but let's cut to her feed. So we can see right now that we're in Pinklight 23's game. She's doing what she loves, playing CSGO. My favorite part of this video is where the map changes from safe house on the monitor here to cobblestone when we go into the actual pre-recorded video. Like they went to the effort of partnering with Steel Series, making this whole room and making it look, you know, foggy and ooh, cool gamery. But making the maps on the screens the same as the pre-recorded bullying footage? Nah. That's too much to ask, man. Also, how does this work? Like, how does the bully hunter join? Like, most games are usually full of people. What if it's like a competitive game or like anything but a casual? How would it, how would it work? It wouldn't work. And let's talk for real. What is this gonna do? Is being killed in a video game and being told, oh, bullying's not a joke. Is that gonna make you not bully? Like, no, it's not. And doing this method to silence people who are being mean to you is a lot less effective than just Doing this. What the f I'm actually gonna f kill you. I'm gonna come to your house and I'm gonna f shoot you. F How would you think of that? Bloody hell. Genius. Now, I'm not saying that harassment in video games isn't an issue. It, it is. Harassment is an issue full stop. Maybe some people overplay it or just make up statistics. Where'd you get that from? But obviously, when harassment does happen, it, it is a bad thing. Definitely. It seems to be a genuine issue with streamers and things like that. I've seen even relatively small ones get, get some weird shit, man. <laughs> and it does seem to be women who are disproportionately affected by this. So, there's something to be said there. There is a genuine conversation. Making a gaming defense leak isn't gonna fix it. It's, it's not helpful. And just owning people in a video game and saying, Bullying isn't a joke, like, oh, come on, like, what's that doing? I don't think the intentions are bad, they seem to genuinely mean well by this, and good on them. They're just misguided. In this case, I think it does a lot more harm than good in the cause of raising awareness against harassment, which is a good cause. But this just makes a joke of it, it just, bully hunters will kill people in the game for you to show them that they're wrong. Something strange. Anyway, I think that does this video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you're new, that'd be great. As always, my social media links for Instagram, Twitter, things like that, down below. Uh, relatively soon, be on the lookout for something new. It begins with M and ends with Urchin Dice. And if you have any ideas for future videos, r slash slazo in the description, or just in the comments, whatever floats your boat. Thank you to my Patreon supporters, and without-